hello guys welcome back to my channel if it's your first time on this channel you are welcome i am an aim coaching i'm an author and i also do business now today's video is basically for that part of my channel where we talk about real life issues okay yes i love you too david okay and um and basically yesterday i did an unboxing video of home testing kit home testing kit and basically in the UK we get these test we can get these testing kits. What? Yeah go and get it. It's there. Okay? What? People have got the tow truck already. People have gone on the tow truck already. People's garden. Yeah. Did you throw it in the garden? No, people left it at somebody's garden. Oh, they put the rubbish in the truck. Okay. No. What? People left it at shop. Oh, they left it at the shop. Yeah. Okay. All right then. What's it? Take it at the shop. Yeah, we'll, we'll go and get it at the post office. Okay. Alright, so basically, um, key workers get these packs, like, they have to test themselves every two days, okay, as part of their work, yeah, um, just to make sure that they don't have COVID-19, okay, however, if you have children, um, nursery age children, or you even have school age children, you, and they have cough, constant cough and they also have the flu um you they have to get tested basically for covid before they go back to school or they go back to nursery now i got this pack because my son had cough and he had the flu as well so um it's the first time i've had it because normally i just take two weeks off um i keep him at home for two weeks until the cough is cleared and then he goes back to nursery but this time around, I got the pack, okay? So, um, you can watch the unboxing home test kit video to see exactly what is in there. So, I did the test on myself because I wanted to see just how, how it works. And basically, you get um, two swabs. Two swabs. Okay, and um, this this is how the swabs look like. And mommy, then, no, don't press anything. Don't press anything. Mommy, mommy, it's okay, wrong. Two of these, mommy, and it's you do wrong, it in your mommy. nose, and then mommy, you do take wrong. the second one and do it in your mouth. Mommy, it's okay, wrong, and mommy. Do, like, mommy, it's wrong. Or where your tonsils no, are mommy, it's to be wrong, you mommy, it's wrong. David, you are talking, 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 no, talking, it's talking. Wrong. Yes, I know, but don't press anything, okay? It's wrong. Thank you. It's wrong. So you do that, Daddy, and then the red button. it also Daddy, comes Daddy, with this it, uh, tube thing. And in this, it's an empty okay. tube thing, and and then it comes with a liquid <laughs> solution, okay? And basically, you open it and you pour the liquid in there, and then you take your swab once you've done your nose you put it in the liquid until it's all all done and you throw this away this and then you do the same thing with the one that you did your tonsils with and you put it in the in there and then and then you get this kit this is a testing the testing thing okay this is what shows you your result and basically you pour it in here okay you pour it this this the solution that's in there you pour it in there and then you wait for 30 minutes okay but it says 30 minutes but it comes up within the within like few minutes okay so you wait and you wait and you wait and it tells you exactly what to expect so mine is negative 
because it's next to the C is negative. So you can either get positive, negative, or um, what's the other one? Uh, that is rice cooked. Um, you get okay. So when it's on the C, it says negative. And then when it's on the, when you get two lines, okay, and the C and then to the T, that means it's positive. And then when it goes to the T, when you get a line on the T, it means void, okay? Void. So I've got the negative, okay? So yeah, so that is it. If you are positive, of course, you go and you get treated and normally you should be well within 10 days, okay? You quarantine for 10 days and then, um, no, 14 days actually, including the weekend. So, yeah. Um, on the website it says that basically when you do your test you're supposed to actually um, report to the NHS report it, your results to the NHS but I think that is just but basically they said because um, whether it's positive, negative or void um, because it helps them to keep tabs on how many people have been infected but I think it does more than that okay sometimes they use it probably probably to ramp up the numbers but anyway if you've had your tests like let me know if you have testing kits do you think um have you found them effective if you're a key worker do you think it's a nuisance i personally i'm so glad that i'm not a key worker thank god for key workers um but i am so glad that i don't have to like go into office or anything like that to work um because i work from home i work for myself so yeah that is it guys if um what's it called if you have any questions put it in the comment section um other than that nothing much to it you can get your home testing kit you literally get seven like a week supply of them and you don't need to be using that regularly so it's very easy um it came within like 